Whoa, whoa, what's going on, nigga? Why aren't you wearing your normal clothes? Nigga, you're going to prison, man. We, we, we lost this case. You're an idiot. What? We didn't lose. Stop playing. You literally snitched on yourself in your latest album. Nigga, what? No, I didn't. Where? You named the album, I shot a nigga with a red shirt, then took his shoes, now I'm facing 25 years! Man, that's just a scenario I made up. The victim was found literally wearing a red shirt with no shoes! That's just an unfortunate coincidence. Nigga, you titled your songs, Judge I Did It. It was at 2.05 p.m. I am guilty. I definitely shot that man. My fresh new sneakers, and the last song is called, I'm facing 25 to life! Whatever, bro. Are you gonna help me? My nigga, you're not beating this case! Then what I pay you for? I'm still trying to figure that out! Okay, is there any lyrics we can use to prove that I'm innocent? Nigga, there is no saving you! In 205, you literally state, it was 205 when I caught that nigga slipping. My girl would have been jealous the way I had that pussy dripping. You can't lie, bro. You know that bar was hard. Nigga, this is exactly why you're gonna be behind them! Bro, is there anything I can do to lessen my sentence? <sighs> You're in the gang R&I, right? Real Niggas Incorporated? Alright, if you snitch on Young Shemmy and Young Remy, the leaders, maybe the judge could give you 10, maybe 5 years. Man, I'm not snitching on nobody, and that's on Young Remy and Young Shemmy. If you don't, you won't be able to see Big Booty Latinas anymore. It was Young Remy, it was Young Shemmy, it was Man Man, they live at 52684 Grove, their grandma stay at Grandma Grove.